guys, hope you're well. Uh, this is a very quick video update on a completed client commission. Uh, about a month and a half ago, we finished a uh, Brass Scorpion for Dave at Mini Wargaming, and uh, off the back of the video going up of um, that, that model, we actually received a number of inquiries regarding uh, getting a few Brass Scorpions done. In front of you, you can see a client completed commission. It's uh, another Brass Scorpion that we've done for one of our clients. Um, had an absolute pleasure working on it. We've gone for the same sort of effect uh, with the model in armour, the cornate sort of symbols that are glowing on the front claws and the front armour plate. Um, same level of uh, sort of painting standard, so we've basically done all the sort of multiple highlighting throughout and all the gold work, all the cabling, all the dead corpses throughout the sort of like the mingled sort of cables have all been picked out, given blood effects. There's a lot of detail that's really gone into this model to really make it pop and stand out. Um, so let's dive on in, have a look at what we've done, uh, and move around the model and just have a look at all the sort of really cool details on it. You don't really see that this model that often. Um, I've seen it a fair few times but I um, don't really see a lot of uh, these models about so it's, uh, it's good to get one in the studio and to really sort of show you guys how, how cool it is. Um, so moving around as you can see Love these armor plates, the way that they stack up. It's like obviously it's a brass scorpion, it's very, very sort of armored, uh, really menacing sort of look. Um, moving around, obviously, some of the legs are pinned, some of them aren't, uh, some of them do move purely because just for, for sort of posing and for sort of like putting it in different sort of poses so it looks like it's charging and things like that. So we've left a, f a few sort of like with the ability to move just to so you can give it a little bit of sort of dynamic sort of posing. Um, again, as you can see, obviously, the, the coordinate symbols here that are glowing on the armor. Um, some of the main legs are, are stabilized firm, like I said, just so that we give it a real sort of firm platform to stand on no matter what sort of gaming surface that you're on. Uh, moving round, as you can see, obviously all the cable work here, some of the dead corpses that are mingled in, the, uh, the sort of, they have been picked out, as I said, with sort of blood effects and sort of multiple highlighting of flesh. Um, really, really enjoyed getting this done. Reese, one of the artists here at the studio, has completed this one. He also painted the mineral gaming uh, scorpion as well. Uh, so just moving around, as you can see, all the mottling in the armour. Love the effect. It really, really comes out really nicely. Um, and we've just really gone to town and it really just pick out all the gold work as well. Uh, absolute pleasure to work on this model. Model. Um, if you uh, if you like what you see uh, and you would like to add a brass scorpion to your army, all our contact details can be found in the description below. We'd love to work on one for you. Um, this is I think the second or third one that we've worked on to date, so it's, uh, we're, we're getting quite accustomed to sort of like how they're built and how to uh, to get the real best out of them uh, when it comes to painting. Um, hope you like the video, guys. As always, please comment, please like, and please subscribe because it really does help us out. Uh, we appreciate it a lot, and uh, we hope to see you on the next video. Look after yourselves, guys, and take care. Bye-bye.